I'm here with the head coach Wendy Fees and Wendy another great step for the program here with the 3-2 win over Kentucky. Right. I mean, what a game. What a game. I think this was the, you know, the fifth game for us. It was the fourth game for Kentucky, but we've been out here at the field for the last 3 days and you could tell both teams were a little tired. Um, but I'll tell you what, the, the early in the game, you couldn't really tell from our kids. I saw it in the warm-ups, but man, once the game started, um, Maddie finally getting her swing right and, and being able to put that ball out into the stratosphere on that home run was huge, getting those early runs. Um, and then Hummel, we knew, um, you know, she'd already pitched 14, 15 innings and um, she was going to have to throw again. And, and we knew she was starting to get a little fatigue, you know, just like any pitcher would after that. But she, uh, she was in great shape. She was in great condition. She got all the way through, had to control her breathing a few times. And, uh, and we really trusted her movement, you know, more than her speed uh, today. And it just, it helped. It was a total team effort because without our defense, you know, we don't win that game. So our defense really, really picked us up. And one thing that's been a struggle in the past is scoring runs early, and you guys have scored nine runs in the five games in the first inning. So, and right. you guys did it again today. Right. All the credit really goes um, to my assistant coaches. I mean, Julie and Nick have worked really hard with our kids and on their approaches and their mental state and their confidence, and just really isolating the game into every pitch in every inning. Um, and you know, I don't know if they have some kind of magic juice or anything, but this team really listens to the, to what they have to say and really steps up and. Um, Every at bat, you could tell they have a purpose, and they're very calm, and, and they just get after it. And when they do have that approach, they're usually successful. Now you guys finished three and two in the tournament with big wins over Ohio State and North Florida. Also, uh, talk about going forward now. Uh. Right. Well, you know, we can celebrate this for the rest of the day, and they can even maybe celebrate it tomorrow on their day off, the wins. I told them to think about all the bad plays and mistakes, though. Now's the time we need to go back and think about all the things we need to work on this week. And then we've got a tough tournament next week in Georgia. You know, when we head to Atlanta, heading to Georgia State, and we're going to play face um, Lipscomb, who's also receiving votes. I mean, we've got a tough schedule. We're running, we're running up against some really tough teams. Um, so we're going to face Lipscomb, we're going to face App State, we're going to face Georgia State on their home field. And anytime you play a team on their home field, it's tough. So I think we just right now we need it. We need a little bit of rest. The girls need to get back in the gym and, and do a little workout. Darn it, our sport. It's not really that. Uh, Fitness, have a fitness level while we're playing it, so we got to make sure we keep our fitness level up when we're not, and uh, and then just prepare for the teams that we're going to play next weekend. All right, well, thanks, Wendy. Good good Thank job you. this uh, week. Thank you.